Maybe a neighbor, maybe even a family member. Delson wrote countless numbers of lives, greatest men. DUP soldiers who gave their lives to save yours. Don't let their sacrifice be in vain. Delson Rowe must be brought to justice, whatever it takes. You want to save these people, Augustine? You want justice? You're going to have to stop me first. And, by the way, good luck with that! Okay, the Transformer's supposed to be on a roof across from it. This is it, y'all. Did you shut the defenses down? No turning back. So what's the plan, Conduit? You're gonna take her alive, show the world what she's done, or just kill her for what she did to Reggie? <laughs> Bitch is gonna die. Okay, I can work with that. Even if the rest of it is still active. Guys are everywhere. That's a setback. Hey D, saw a trail of bodies over in Pioneer. Glad of you and followed them. Hope you don't mind. I had that covered, you know. Oh, I know, but the hell you did. So this means you're along for the ride? You kidding? My two favorite people in the world in a knockdown drag out? Wouldn't miss it for the world. There you go. More smoke toys. Come in handy.
that? That's your lifesaver. Hey, Fetch! This would be a good time for some backup! Ask and ye shall receive! Gene! Man, you sure know how to level a playing field. It's good to have friends in high places! Feel the wrath of my demons! Easy on the trash talk, Eugene! Pad for you. Oh, you think that's gonna save you? Looks like it's time to pull out the new tricks. Looks like the whole roof's armor plate. Let me try the high beams on it. Uh, you sure you can cut through? Yeah, if you and Teen Angel there can keep the dukes off my ass. Fear not, or I shall protect you. How's it coming, Fetch? Don't rush me, Dean. I don't like being rushed. I'm almost there. Got it. All yours, Dean. You go inside and grab Augustine. Eugene and I will keep these guys off your back. Go forth and enter the dominion of Augustine. The lady and I will cover you. So, any trouble finding the place? I know all about what you did. Using Hank to set up the crash. Making Eugene and Fetch look like monsters to scare the shit out of the city. All so you could swoop in and be the hero. I did what I had to to protect conduits. Protect? You hunt them down. You lock them up. And you train them to kill. I needed Abigail and Eugene to be monsters, because without monsters, the monster hunters go out of business. So that's what this is all about, huh? Job security? And you almost derailed the whole operation. Luckily, you turned out to be the best thing that ever happened to me. You hear them out there? They want your. And once the world sees the head of the D.U.P. saving them from the biggest bioterrorist threat of the last seven years, your death will buy my D.U.P. at least 20 more years of funding. I'm so glad we met when we did. <laughs> Don't be. Oh. oh no. Are you gonna kill me now? You goddamn right I am.
You want my power? Seven years ago, my unit was there to save lives from a new threat. Conduits. People with powers that no one understood. They had the power to kill. And the power to transform some of us into conduits too. I found another survivor. She tailed me as I made my way back to the safety of my battalion. Together we traveled through a lawless city that wanted us dead because of what we now were. Every day, people joined the lynch mob, horrified by the thought of conduits hiding among them. We'd hurt no one, but they could only see us as monsters. When military order finally asserted itself, they treated us as the threat. I was conduit. I was military. But I couldn't be both. So I made another option. It was the only way. By bringing in that first conduit alive, I'd earned the government's trust. And that was just the start. They funded the creation of the DUP, thinking we were just freaks, hunting down other freaks. But that wasn't it. I was going to save as many conduits as I could. If my kind were going to live, it'd be behind the walls of Curtin K. Seven years, I've kept them safe. Me. I won't let anyone undo that. Not the government. Not the army. Not you. Seven years, all you've done is keep them locked up. You just took away their freedom. So tell me, what would you do? Just throw open the gates at Curtin K Station? Set them all free? You bet your ass I would. The world hasn't changed in the past seven years. Inside, the conduits are safe. They're alive. If you turn them out, they'd all be dead inside a week. So tell me, who's the savior? And who's the monster? This is what you wanted. You win. We both have the same power. Only difference is, I've had seven years to practice.
gonna need. That hurts. Augustine had come to Seattle with a plan to spread fear, panic, chaos, make herself out to be a hero. But her plan was soon shattered by monsters she had made. Fetch, Eugene, and me. For two weeks, Augustine had controlled Seattle. Now it was our turn. Who the hell was gonna stop us? Oh, and the hundreds of conduits Augustine had locked away at Curtin K Station? I'm gonna shake each and every one of their hands on their way out the door. So many different powers, all in one place. <laughs> I'll be the kid in the candy store. But first, I had a promise to take care of. Hey, Akomish Nation! Local heroes back home. There's my girl. Whoa, 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 slow down. What? Come back to save the day. The TV news showed everything. It showed everything. Okay, look, about I the... saw you kill dozens of innocent people. What did you want me to do? Okay, I wasn't gonna let anybody or anything stop me from getting back to you to, to save everybody. We're Akomish. We take care of our own, right? Hey, hey, take it easy. 
You have disgraced our people. You have disgraced our ancestors. And you have disgraced the memory of your brother. You are a Comish no longer. You, everybody else, will die without me. Or have you forgotten that? We haven't forgotten. And we will never forget. But... <laughs> 